there's something so fun about playing catch in the water. In the summertime, I know my kids can spend hours and hours and hours in that water. And Waboba is the first ball designed to actually bounce on the water. In fact, so much more than skipping a stone. And you don't need any talent like you do when you skip a stone. You just throw this ball and it will just bounce even up to 25 times across the water. There's a huge fan base and a whole group of people have created games that can only be played with the Waboba ball. They call themselves Wobobians and the games are played all over the world from Australia to the Dead Sea to California and anywhere you can think of where there's water. Pools, lakes, oceans, rivers, even puddles in the rain. And one of those games is actually the catch which comes with a mitt and a ball. Jan van Halen is the founder and he's from Sweden. He came up with this idea while he was watching his kids play in the water on a family vacation. The Waboba ball was invented not just here, but down on the beach. It started by me playing as usual with my sons, but this time I threw a frisbee upside down and it bounced and it came up again and, and my son caught it. We've been getting hundreds of um, from newly invented games from all you Waboba players around the world. And there's a lot more to invent. What we've done is we've taken ball to, wa to water. Now please use it on water. Find new games. So part of what makes playing with the Waboba so fun and so compelling is that you can really see and feel the technology inside. So when it hits the top of the water, it flattens out like a stone. And when you play with it, you can sort of feel what's inside there jostling around. And it won't sink. And it also won't bounce on land. This is the perfect addition to your summer arsenal of toys. Thank you.